And there's Matt Austin. Well, you know I like him. Hey, I've been I've talked about him for about three years now. I've been knowing him since he was a little tight. But uh, this guy right here, as I said in the uh, at the open of the show, he's learning how to win. And so he's just going along taking care of business. He knows now that this is another check. He's quit entertaining himself, and he's riding these bulls. Watch this. Ralph oh Bart. This is, I guarantee you, he could look up there and talk to that back judge and say, how am I doing, boss? You know, <laughs> he rides this bull. That is so easy. Uh, it's amazing. Boy, that was fun. He's going to get a great score. I mean, he rode this bull like he owned him. Look at that. And the guys behind the chute, they're getting that sinking feeling. We watched him win an extreme bull stop in Salt Lake City a couple of years ago. And since then, the momentum just continues to build for Matt Austin. Almost won the world title a year ago. And this year, Donnie, looking like a world champ. I mean, he looks like a world champion right there. And uh, th that is absolutely picture perfect. One, just a, a great ride. And uh, we, I think we hurt the leaderboard. So Matt Austin, 90 and a half points. Going to bump Terry Don West by a half point. Only a half point. You got to ride two, Jeff. That's when it really means something on that second bull. Brimming with confidence and Matt Austin starting to ride those bulls when it really matters and putting the heat on the competition. Lots still to come, though, in this round. More from Birmingham in just a moment.